Okay, so what's so great about this pattern stamp tool? And it's really quite simple. Up here at the top, it's this impressionist brush setting. So whenever you've got that impressionist brush setting checked, then when you grab the pattern stamp tool, select your brush and have that checked, whatever colors are right here in the um, pattern are gonna come out of your brush. However, if you just grab a standard brush from Photoshop, it's not gonna look really great. I'm gonna give you a demonstration here. So I actually went to Photoshop's site and downloaded one of the default watercolor brushes. And now I'm going to use that watercolor brush and paint like this. So this is a default brush. Now, it's cool to have a rainbow brush, but what's really happening there is it's just bands of color. But, and that's gonna happen with most default brushes. But what I did with lots of experimentation is I discovered a way to engineer the brush with the spacing, the scatter, the dual brush settings so that um, I could engineer the brush and have the colors dispersed in really amazing ways to create the kind of effects that I want. So for example, here is a watercolor brush um, that I created using this technique. And I think you'll agree, this looks a lot more watercolory. So that gives you an idea of the amazing kind of color blending magic that we can do with this technique. And in the following videos, I'm gonna show you all of the fundamentals so that you can master this technique and it's super easy.